Hey crew, it's GKB here with another great video for you. Today I will be talking about the crazy server spikes and sales of Black Ops 1 after the news of the game releasing on back compat for the Xbox One. So let's get into the video. It's here, it's finally here. When we first heard that Black Ops 1 was coming to back compat around last November, there was some excitement. The months after have been met with some backlash as to why it hasn't been released as of yet. Now it's here and oh man the response from social media has been enormous. Now a lot of people, myself included, stated that they changed the new movement system so much and everyone got used to boosting and wall running that it would be almost impossible at this point to go back to the traditional COD boots on the ground playstyle. Well if this is any indication of how wrong we were, I don't know what is. The player base before playing Black Ops 1 was around 3 to 5k. Now after the announcement of Blops being back compat, the servers went from 5k to 80k plus the first night. Going into the weekend, I could see player base easily spike well over 100k. I want to talk about how some people will say, you know, back compat is not a huge feature and for some games like indies and such, they're right, it's not. When a game like this is released to back and pat, it is a big deal for Microsoft and the devs. Black Ops 1 has gone up on Amazon's sales chart and not to mention breathe some new life into a game that many people weren't playing. This also might give Activision a push to get Call of Duty back to its roots. Okay, on to how the game plays. I had such a great time grabbing my FAMAS loadout and tearing it up on the multiplayer. Now this game released back in November of 2010, so the graphics are a bit dated to today's standards, but still holds up well. From initial analysis, the game performs better on Xbox One than it did on the 360. That's great news because it's an FPS game and if it's not up to par for you, you'll be at a disadvantage while playing the multiplayer. I did have a few lag spikes that could be due to host internet connections or just the sheer number of players that were playing at that time. Overall though, my experiences with Black Ops has been great. While playing it brought back some great memories I had while playing when it first released. Um, with a deal going on of $9.99 for Blops, why not pick it up and enjoy some great good old boots on the ground COD. Well that's it, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, go ahead and skull crush the crap out of that like button, share and subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching, and take care of your fellow gamers.